What are some jobs that teenagers can do? Today I'm going to go ahead and share with you guys specific companies that are hiring teenagers that actually pay a decent wage. I'm also going to share with you guys some entrepreneur type jobs you guys can start up on your own, whether you're in high school still or whether you just got out of high school. These are great jobs for teenagers. I can't wait to share this with you guys today. Good day subscribers and specifically good day to you teenage subscribers out there and you parents that have teenagers that you want them to go get a job because today's video is really going to help. I'm going to give specific companies that are hiring teenagers and I'm going to go ahead and discuss a lot of entrepreneur type jobs, teenagers you can go ahead and start on your own and make some money on the side. So let's go ahead and get into this. First for first things first, I want to go ahead and discuss the companies that I'm talking about that are hiring that pay decent wages. So there's really three companies out there that um, I want you to take a look at. And if you've never heard of these companies or they're not in your state, then you're kind of out of luck and you'll probably have to go somewhere else. But company number one, and there's a good chance if you live in America, you have one of these, and it's Costco. Costco, that's number one. They start their average wage at like $12 plus dollars an hour. So for part-time help, and that's a really good job, you know, you can get as a part-timer. Now they don't have a ton of teenagers that work there. So if you get in there as a teenager, you're very privileged. If you notice, uh, a lot of people at Costco are usually in their 20s, 30s, 40s, and whatnot that work there. So that's probably the hardest one of these three to get into. The next one is a delicious place and it's called in and out burger in and out burger so unless you live in california arizona nevada texas and i think utah you're probably out of luck on this one but they usually start their wages around 11 dollars plus an hour and all you're doing is making burgers, taking orders, doing french fries and things. So they pay well above the minimum wage. And the last company is called Quick Trip. Quick Trip. Quick Trip. They're a convenience store chain. And they usually pay a dollar to two dollars above minimum wage. But they also give you a lot of bonuses the longer you stay with the company. And they're extremely easy to work with as far as scheduling goes. Whether you need to work 20 hours a week, 10 hours a week, 30 hours a week, they're a great company to work for if you're looking for part-time work as a teenager. And there's tons of young people. I mean, the majority of people that work there in the stores are honestly under 25 years old, whether they're managers or they're part-time workers. So that's really a great option. So... Costco, In-N-Out Burger, Quick Trip. Those are three companies um, that you probably want to start with applying. If you don't get in there, then let's go ahead and go to the next step. And I'm going to tell you guys about a few different entrepreneur type jobs where you can make some money on the side and you can start these businesses on your own. So, and really kind of have your own hours and whatnot. I got a big eraser. Look at that. Woohoo! Okay. So, job number one, and a lot of these jobs I'm going to mention are kind of manual labor intensive jobs. So you got to be willing to work, but there's no such thing as a free lunch. Number one, landscaping. Landscaping. Job number one, landscaping. You can go around your neighborhood, look at the houses that maybe need their trees trimmed or grass cut, things like that. Get yourself a little thing of business cards from Vistaprint. You can get like 150 cards for, I think it's like 10 bucks, seven bucks, 10 bucks. And, you know, give them your business card and say, hey, uh, you know, I'll charge you 25 bucks. Knock on the door. I'll charge you 25 bucks for, you know, cutting this grass right here or charge you 30 bucks. I'll cut your grass and I'll cut that tree right there. Whatever. It's a great way to get income and you just kind of go around your neighborhood and whatnot. See all your neighbors. Some of them you'll probably know. Some of them you probably won't know. And offer to go ahead and help them out in this way and more than likely they're going to be kind of interested because your wage is probably going to be lower lower than someone that's older and doing that type of job so that's a good possibility landscaping another job is 
going around and detailing cars at a house. So I'm going to go ahead and write that one. We're just going to call it detail. So basically you go around house to house and all you have to know is how to clean a car. So you use the person's hose that they, that they have there or whatnot. You buy yourself a bucket, you buy yourself the soap, and you buy yourself one of those little hand vacuums, or you use your parents if they have one. And you just go house to house, pass out your business cards. Hey, I do car detailing. And once you get your first customer or you do your parents' car or whoever, make sure you take some pictures of it so it looks really good. And then you can pull it up on your phone right there when you're at the customer's house and say, hey, look at this. I did this uh, person's car and look at how nice it came out and whatnot. I'll do yours, you know, 15 bucks, 20 bucks. It'll take me about an hour and I'll just have it looking beautiful. I clean all the inside. I do the outside, it's just gonna look phenomenal. So that's another great uh, job. Detailing cars, house to house. It takes very little money to start. Even, I mean, your parents might even have a bucket and soap already in their house, so you can just use theirs. So it, that's another great job to have. Um, some other type of jobs you can have are like babysitting, but babysitting is getting a little harder because now parents more and more are looking at um are you like certified and uh if someone starts choking do you know how to give them the heimlich things like that so you're looking for more like certifications nowadays so it's harder to get into babysitting um but it's another possibility a great one is dog sitting this is something a lot of people need so i'm gonna write it down here dog man my handwriting's so messed up dog sitting that's another job that's a great job where you can go house to house, give out your business card, say, hey, um, you know, I'll walk your dogs or I'll do whatever. And a lot of people love that, you know, their dogs need to go get walked or whatever at lunchtime. They can't do it because they're working. So they hire you, they pay you 10, 15 bucks for that hour you go over there and you could just go all around your neighborhood and whatnot. It's summertime. You probably have nothing to do anyway. So it's a great little job you can do there. So these are just three um, ideas of jobs. There's a million different ones you can start for basically no money that you can probably use your parents' equipment on. You know, landscaping, you can probably use your dad's lawnmower uh, and tree trimmer. Detailing cars, you can use probably your parents' bucket or soap or whatnot. And dog sitting, you basically don't even need any equipment for that. So they're all jobs that basically don't cost any money to get into other than get business cards. Don't matter what, even if you're a teenager, you want to get some business cards made just so you can hand it out. It's got your phone number on it. It's got your email address on it, that, that type of thing. So I hope this helped today, guys. Um, Costco, In-N-Out Burger, Quick Trip. Those are the first three you want to try to get uh, in with. Can't get in that? Start your own business. You know, little entrepreneur business. It's not like you're starting some big thing. You're just starting a little business. And then if... You're not one to start your own business. You don't get hired by those three companies. There's always the McDonald's, Burger King, Taco Bell, Walmart, all those kinds of places you can apply that are always hiring part-time help. But you're probably going to get hired in at minimum wage or something close to minimum wage. So don't get your hopes up too much about that. That's like the last step fallback you want to really take. I thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this, teenagers, and you guys that are parents of teenagers. Um, let's not just sit home and sit on the couch all summer, you know, let's do something. Let's make some money. Yeah. Anyways, guys, have a great day and thank you for watching.